This year, voters are being asked to choose three out of five county commissioners in Spokane. But what does a county commissioner even do, and what powers do they actually have? Well, you can think of them like the city council, but for the entire county, they enact ordinances and approve budgets, oversee spending and hiring for the entire county. And the only contested race is between Republican incumbent Al French and Democratic challenger Molly Marshall. The two will battle it out in District 5. That district covers the area shaded in blue here on your screen. It covers most of the western part of the county, including Cheney, Airway Heights, and Medical Lake. Our Alexandra Cohenyard spoke with both candidates. And Alexandra, what makes this such an important race? Derek and Kirsten, the area covered in the district is rapidly growing. And for the last few years, it has been dealing with a PFAS contamination. Hundreds of thousands of dollars have been poured into this race, both for and against candidates. And the winner will decide the party majority of the Board of Commissioners in Spokane County. Molly Marshall and incumbent Al French have different priorities for the 5th District in Spokane County. For French, the focus is on crime. For Marshall, it is on the PFAS contamination the area has been dealing with for years. First step is really getting a group together, a, a task force uh, full of community members and experts to start working this issue. Those living in the area have expressed a lack of transparency on the PFAS contamination issue, but French claims he has a plan to address it. And we are working very aggressively to go after state money and federal money to provide filtration systems for those that live in the rural areas. French persists that his commitment, if reelected, is to provide resources for public safety agencies. Um, you know, the uh, crime rate, uh, uh, pretty in the city, but that uh, creeps out into the county, uh, is being challenged with uh, uh, some of the policies at the city. Both candidates are in agreement that the lack of infrastructure supporting the area's development is a pressing issue. This concern is what motivated Marshall to run. In the comp plan, you need to put infrastructure in place prior to development or while it's being developed and, and get that financial commitment within six years of this development. That hasn't happened. French argues he is in the process of working with the city to improve the infrastructure of the area. Ads against French from special interest groups have been released in recent weeks, and a recall effort was launched against him in August. Marshall told us she was not involved with either of these instances. During the primary, French beat Marshall by less than 1,000 votes. This is a complicated one. You can read about both candidates on our website at kxly.com. Live in studio, Alexander Coneyards, 4 News Now.